Hello again, and welcome back to another one. And today we have a couple of topics to cover, from what looks to be a teaser from Snoop and Who Kids IG linked to Eminem, to more from Salma Hayek, who recently spoke about meeting Eminem at the Oscars in 2020, and there's something about Eminem that gets people animated, that's for sure. And he comes out exactly on the side that I am in, and I just, I'm so <laughs> nervous, I love you, I love you! And this reminded me of a recent interview where Fresher also talked about working with Eminem, and it was similar vibes. You got a verse? I said, what? Do I have a verse? Ah! Oh, do I have shit. a verse? I just fucked up my Do, me, do I have a verse? Shit. I'm in there. I said, yo, I got a verse. I ain't have a verse. I just had a hook because I knew what he wanted. We'll get to more on this in a bit, and a few hours ago, Eminem was trending on Twitter after Netflix revealed the cast of the live-action adaptation of One Piece, and anime fans did their thing. And at the latter part of the video, we'll explore an Eminem appreciation post from the Universal Hip Hop Museum on Twitter. And before we get started, if you enjoy content like this, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and find me on social media at ETLifestyle on the score web. So when the cast of One Piece was revealed, the actor set to play Sanji quickly sparked reactions linked to Eminem, and this happened. Eminem is trending with Sanji, y'all too quick. And that's thanks to thousands of tweets like this. Yo, they got Eminem in the live action One Piece, yo. And many legit believes he looks like Eminem, ayo, slim Sanji. And apparently one of the characters in the anime was reportedly inspired by Eminem and stakes like, Eminem needs to play as Eno. That guy was literally inspired by Eminem, and it says, Eiichiro Oda, creator of One Piece, is a fan of Eminem, and the character Eno from One Piece is visually based on Eminem. But what do you guys think? Here's a side by side. The One Piece live actor for Sanji looks like Eminem, do y'all see it? And moving on a few days ago, Snoop Dogg shared a post announcing something for the 16th of November. That's next Tuesday. Cameo presents Snoop Dogg breaking the algorithm, and you can spot DJ Who Kid in the comments with the fire emojis. And a few hours ago, this happened that sparked discussions online. Who Kid edited a picture of Eminem and added the laughing emojis and Tuesday. And Snoop Dogg reposted this on his IG, and now some are wondering on Twitter asking, is it a hint related to the rumored collab between Snoop and M for Snoop's forthcoming album? Well, we know Snoop's cooking something for next Tuesday as seen on IG, perhaps it's connected. And so the poster user reacted and alluded to Fred Rex in quotes tantrums, the last time fan theories flooded the web that started from him. I saw his IG story but didn't pay much attention to it, maybe he just randomly posted it anyway. And to be honest, I don't like getting my hopes up anymore. Maybe Fred Rec will come out and call us in quotes obsessed stands again, lol. Right now we know that Eminem will be on Mount Westmore's album slated for January 2022. Snoop confirmed this in an interview with Rolling Stone, but I don't know if Eminem will be on Algorithm that's dropping next Friday, 19th of November. The date was moved up as initially, the album was slated for the 12th, but back on topic, what do you guys think of the Tuesday tease? Could Eminem be linked to the post about breaking the algorithm slated for Tuesday, or are they just trolling? Moving on to the next topic at hand, Salma Hayek was recently on the Kelly Clarkson show, and she explained how it was a nicely kept secret, as no one expected Eminem to be performing, and it took her by surprise when she saw him. And he comes out exactly on the side that I am in, and I just, I'm so nervous, <laughs> I love you, I love you! Oh, you're shaking the water. <laughs> I spit it out. <gasps> And she elaborated on how this happened, as fans on the internet were wondering why they both looked like they saw a ghost when they surfaced after the show. And then I see that he's like, and I go, First of all, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, <laughs> take a picture. <laughs> and the next day, I went home and I said, Oh my God, my hero thinks I'm a freak. And the next morning, they asked him because it was a big deal, it was a surprise. Yes. And he said something like, Oh, I, I really enjoyed it because I got to meet Salma Hayek. Yeah, I got, yeah! That was so- And following this clip, some believe this is so funny. That explains why Eminem was looking scared at the photos. Now, this is not the first time she spoke about this meeting, and back in 2020, after the show, she dropped a lengthy post on social media explaining it. And this video has sparked reactions like, she said, oh my god, my hero thinks I'm a freak. She is really a stan, OMG, I love her. Well, she included in the post from 2020 she believes Eminem is the GOAT, and this interview gave it away, you can tell she really believes that. 
We've already covered a report that showed that when it comes to rappers rating rappers, Eminem came out on top as the GOAT. Many celebrities share the same view, and when it comes to feats and accomplishments, Slash Records is number one around the world. But why do people get so triggered when a rap fan calls Eminem the GOAT? And here's an appreciation post from the Universal Hip Hop Museum on that note. Imagine being poor, white, and from Detroit, but being obsessed with rap music. Now add to that mix that you think you can move your obsession into a career. That's exactly the space the former battle rapper Eminem found himself growing up, proving that hard work can cross color lines and cultural biases. In addition to Slim Shady getting on, landing on the top of the charts almost every time he releases a project and making history as the first rap artist to go diamond twice, he also is a real student of his craft. Check all the times he hopped on a beat with a Jay-Z or a Nas and arguably best at most people's best MC. This in quotes Know Ya Hip Hop Moment was brought to you by Universal Hip Hop Museum and AllHipHop.com. Since it's Eminem somewhere quick to point out a blue tech praising M, I'm smiling loving my eyes emoji and this post sparked more like yeah but he can rap insanely well, I don't give a f what anyone says, his raps need to be in poetry library to teach syllables, nobody will ever be that technical. This take reminds me of videos about English professors talking about Eminem's ability. Rap God is one of those performances that verges on the impossible. Well, that will be all for today. Share your thoughts below. Thanks for watching and see you on the next one.